scientists just invented a mini human brain, and it fits on your fingertip. MIT calls it the my brain, and it's not just a blob of cells. It's alive with neurons firing, immune cells reacting, and even tiny blood vessel structures. And here's the wild part. It has all six major human brain cell types. No one has ever done that before. They grew it entirely from stem cells taken from individual donors. So every MyBrain is technically a tiny, personalized brain model. Why does this matter? Because this can replace animal testing in drug discovery. These mini-brains self-assemble into functioning units, forming neural circuits, blood-brain barriers, even immune responses. And then MIT tested something huge, the APOE4 gene variant, the strongest genetic risk factor for Alzheimer's. With my brains, they finally watched, in real time, how APOE4 astrocytes trigger toxic amyloid and tau buildup. But here's the twist. They only turned dangerous when other brain cells were present. Alone, they were harmless. Meaning Alzheimer's pathology might come from cell-to-cell -cell miscommunication, not just one bad gene. MIT even discovered microglia and astrocytes have to team up to produce the most harmful tau. This opens the door to targeted therapies that block their conversations instead of attacking the whole brain. And get this, my brains could eventually be made for each person, turning drug testing into personalized medicine. A lab-grown brain, modeled after you, predicting which treatments will work. We might be stepping into a future where your doctor prescribes drugs tested on your mini-brain first. Follow for more future tech breakthroughs.